In today's video, I want to talk about the Sky Art Programme Sky Portrait Artist of the Year and Sky Landscape Artist of the Year. I see a lot of talk online in, in, in certain art communities about it being a negative kind of thing with regards to art and it's sort of the sportification of art. For me, I don't see that. What I see, are, number one, is making art bit more accessible to everybody again art should be about accessible art should be something for everyone everyone is capable of making art everybody should celebrate the fact that they can make wonderful art everyone can make wonderful art um, and I think it's really wonderful that we've got programs on mainstream TV that just promote drawing and painting and the love of art. The judges themselves are genuinely people who, if you cut them open, they would bleed, you know, art. They would bleed paint. I'm sure I'm sure that would be the case for Taishan Shira. For me, it's placing art back in a kind of higher, sort of high, more high-minded, you know. It's giving it a little bit more credence and cre uh, like sort of a bigger kind of reputation than it has had in say education over the last few years. I can only speak from um, experience in the UK, but, and I don't know, like comment below if, if this is the case anywhere else. But for me, art has been kind of denigrated in the education system over the last few years. You've got the important subjects like maths, English and science. Then you've got the, the less important subjects like art and music, you know, those creative pursuits that aren't really going to give you a career. <laughs> anyway, um, and I think that's sad. I think that's absolutely sad. Like, if you've got someone, a child who loves, genuinely loves art, then to hear someone, an adult that they respect, turn around and tell them that it isn't important, or that the, you know, kind of insinuate that it isn't as important as maths, English and science, um, I'm not saying that maths, English and science aren't important, but I don't see it as like, they're all important. I, I guarantee you Pablo Picasso didn't think that science was as important as his art was to him. You know, I'm sure he could pay people to do his accountancy and things like that. So maths wasn't important, you know, um, it's all subjective, I know. And um, everybody's case is different. But we as a as a society, I don't think are really helping our young children to explore art and explore the love of painting and the love of drawing. Painting and drawing and creating something from your brain and putting it on paper is a process that is, we all know if we paint, if we draw, we all know it's quite calming, it's quite meditative. You like you leave all the noise at the door, you close the studio door and boom, you're on it. So. I think we've denied children that, which this might be controversial, I hope it's not, but I think that there's been a distinct rise in mental health issues with children and I don't know if you could perhaps correlate that with the decline in the arts subjects um, and the importance within schools of that, so that's something to kind of think about. But this is just for me, like I know I've gone off on a tangent here, I do that, i am gone off on a tangent, but it's for me, um, Sky, Sky Arts has done something which has really helped ignite art again in the mindset and the consciousness of, you know, everybody who watches it. I don't know how, when I do art trails and things, and I know there's an art trail and it's a, you know, the audience is there for it, but there's so many people that just watch it because it is just enjoyable. So many people are now investing in sketchbooks. So many people are picking up pencils and pens. And adults, this is really important. If you love drawing, if you love painting, do it. If, especially if you've got children, do it, all right? Simply because your child will then see you draw. It's not about being good. It's not about being bad. It's not about being, oh, I used to be this. Just do it for the sake of it. Don't try and create a masterpiece. Just draw, just paint, because it's drawing and painting. And at the end of the day, it's something that we love to do. If your child is seeing you do something that you love, then they will do something that they love. It's really, really important. You might not make a career out of it, 
but you're doing something. You're, you're not sitting down putting the TV on and going, oh. You're sitting down and you're drawing. You're sitting down and you're painting. And your kids will want to join in with you. My kids come to the studio all the time and we paint and we draw and we just, it's wonderful. It really is. And we have conversations about painting and drawing, which is absolutely amazing. So thank you, Sky Art, for Sky Portrait Artist and Sky Landscape Artist. I think it's absolutely marvellous what you've done. And it really has helped ignite the kind of art thoughts in the, in these in the UK society and I, I'm sure around the world um, so yeah just a little video from me today to sort of talk about this if you've enjoyed that then leave a like subscribe have a wonderful day and whatever you do today make some art